Richard Zebuganda, a third year student of biomedical science at Makari University, early this week suffered a severe injury to his right hand after a tear gas canister exploded in his room. The unfortunate incident is currently under investigation by the police. We managed to talk to Sebuganda today, hours before he was wheeled into a theater for surgery on his hand. I abruptly just had something. Eh? I think usually these canisters, they make two sounds. Eh? So I think it was the initial sound, so it went up. Eh? So when it went up, me, I was resting on my bed like this. Eh? So I immediately turned up, so it was coming back towards my chest. So in a protection way, when it when it came close, I did this. So, and I did this after some time, I just looked at my hand and it was all messy. Sebuganda says he first got first aid at the university hospital, which referred him to Mulago Casualty Ward. They took me, but I was bleeding intensely. Even the swapping I had was full of blood, like it was just flowing. The student says that the doctors have so far told him which option he has for his hand. That is cutting off the hand from the wrist. Another one is plastic surgery, which they're actually working on right now. But it's a process, that's what I can say. So if this is to fail, maybe they would resort to the last option, amputation. That is removing off the hand from the wrist. Sebuganda, who is in his third year, says he has not yet got support from police and the university administration. Everything is being catered for from some Samaritans, my friends and my dad. But police and the university have not seen anything into action as of now. Even now, it is now three, three to four days and the university has not come out to make a statement. Police has not yet come out to make a statement. It shows that this was taken for granted. But this is a human life that was destroyed. However, in a letter sent by NTV from the university management and the members of the Guild Cabinet, resolved to assist and I quote, with any implication of Mr. Sebuganda's injury on his academic program and any necessary support shall be handled directly with him. End of quote. Raymond Tamale, NTV.